Okay, in this video we're going to talk about how we construct the cardboard box for the box frame and how to cut the cardboard using a knife and a steel ruler. Okay, so the normal size of the box that you're going to be making will be around about A5 size, which is 148 by 210. Now I'm making a slightly different box size for mine. So uh, I've cut this already at 160 millimeters wide and I want it to be 160 deep. Okay, so it's going to be a square frame rather than a five. Now I've marked, I've measured and marked 160. Now I use my steel ruler to line this up. Now you could draw your line to make sure you're accurate if you wanted to. What you're going to need to do is once you've drawn your line, you've put your marks down, you're going to need to line up your rule, okay, your metal rule and bridge your hands. Now you see that my fingers and my thumb are holding down the rule in the, the channel here and supporting with the other three fingers. So, so I'm making a nice bridge shape like so, so that none of it moves. Okay, it's really important that you, you keep this nice and still, but also keep the cardboard from moving as well. Now I'm using a, a Stanley knife here and all I'm gonna do, the first pass, I'm just gonna do a rough, score across the top. I'm not pushing too hard, okay, I'm just letting most of the, mo the, the knife do most of the work and after about three or four uh, runs over the cardboard it makes a nice clean cut, okay. So that is the back of my box, okay. So now I'm going to make the sides and I want my box to be quite deep, okay. So I'm going to make it about 120 deep. Um, so I'm going to use this cardboard here, okay, and all I'm going to do is measure 120 millimetres, 120 millimetres, and then score down like so. And that's one bit, and then we'll do another piece, 120 millimetres, 120 millimetres. Okay, and again, using the safety rule, I line it up, one, two, three, four, there you go, nice. It's quite important you do it on a cutting mat as well, it keeps it nice and clean. Right, so those are the two sides, or the top and bottom, depends how you want it. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get this to the right width. Okay, so it's 160, but what I tend to do is I just line up, I line up my back with the side, and I just draw a line down this side to get the exact width. Okay, and then all I'm going to do, using my rule, again, one, two, three, Okay, and that's the width. And again, I'm going to do the same again on this side. Okay, the width, and I just draw a line down here, and then one, two, three, four. Okay, so that's my top and bottom, and now I'm just going to cut the, the width for the sides. Okay, again, um, these are going to be 120 wide. So it's 120 millimeters for this one. Lining them up, and again, bridge the hands, keep it nice and still. One, two, Three, four. Notice how I'm cutting. I've just put my finger on the top, my thumb on the sides, holding it like so. Okay, and that's another. Uh, that's an, a side. And one twenty. And 
another side. So I'm going to put those sides to the side. 